This is crazy. I did not kill Edmund. Uh, trust me, you're going to have to do a lot better than that to convince her. You can start by telling us when you last flew your plane. Not for weeks. You can check. We intend to. Now, where were you at 9.30 last night? I was at the Harlem Youth Center handing out gifts to kids. I wasn't anywhere near Edmund. But you did engage in some unsanctified behavior at his apartment. Is that what this is about? That was nothing. You threatened to kill him, and now he's dead. I wouldn't call that nothing. I can explain that, okay? See, Edmund took one of my best gigs. It was a print ad for Cartier. I was their go-to Santa. You know, this year they wanted to go more warm and cuddly. Well, look at me. I'm warm, I'm cuddly, but no, they chose Edmund, so... Yeah, I drank too much peppermint schnapps and went over to his place and popped off. I'm not proud of it. But that was all I did. Did you see him again after that? No. You have to understand. When I first met Edmund five years ago, he was at a low point in life. I raised him up. I taught him everything I knew. I turned him into a world-class Santa, and now I'm losing gigs to him? Well, maybe that's it. Maybe it's time to hang up the fluffy red jockstrap. It... Is that a metaphor, or do you... Really... Uh, when Edmund was killed, he was wearing his Santa suit. Do you know if he had a job last night? You have to ask his agent. Santas have agents? Yeah, mostly we use the Bells and Holly agency. You said Edmund was at a low point in his life. What did you mean by that? I just think he became a Santa to turn his life around. And it worked, too. Turn his life around? Is he in trouble of some sort? All I know is back when I met him, Edmund was a totally different guy.